Hello everybody! Today we're going to unbox and take a close up look at the Nike Air More Up Tempo Low Cross Ambush Black and White. So let's just take a look around the outside of the box. So in this box is a pair of Nike Air More Up Tempo Low Cross Ambush Unisex shoes, and this pair is an immense UK size 9, USA size 10, European size 44, Brazil size 42, 28 centimeters, and it's in the women's USA size 11 and a half, and it's in a black, white, black colorway. And now let's go ahead and open up the box by flipping up the box lid to reveal the contents inside and giving you a good and clear look inside of the box packaging. Let's peel back the packing paper or wrapping paper and folding back the inner wrapper as well and giving you a look at the shoe as it sits in the box. Now let's lift out the Nike Air more up-tempo low cross ambush we're just setting the box to the side for now as we focus on the shoe itself so giving you a look at the shoe and let's do a 360 rotation so you have a full and clear look So we can see the overall black and white colorway or design and taking a closer in look at the details of the shoe so we can see at the front with the nike white embroidered swoosh on the toe box and of course the very fine suede layers or panels making up the front or upper part of the shoe. And of course, we can see the Nike Air logo in the graffiti pop art inspired style with a low sheen to it. So giving you a much closer in look at the details right there and the stitching details as well. And of course, quite obviously we can see the Nike Air unit right across and through the opposite side of the shoe. So as we move further towards the back, plenty of details and you can see the somewhat chunky and bulbous design of the shoe. And once again, following through on the pop art graffiti inspired air logo just going to press down on it to give you some idea of that padded or bolstered logo and of course giving you a look at the texture of the very fine grain leather making up the air font logo and branding Okay, and of course, continuing back down and back, you can see a deep shade of blue inside of the air unit in the heel part of the shoe. And of course, you can see a very highly raised midsole forming the kind of midfoot all the way to the rear heel counter of the shoe and taking a look directly from the back we can see the nike swoosh and right below it the ambush branding so there's a nike cross ambush or nike x ambush collaboration or co-branded product and once again seeing that deep blue azure hue of that air unit in the heel part of the shoe and of course taking a look at the ambush details so it does raise out from the heel counter of the shoe just giving you a look right there from the profile so you can see it does stick out from 
the surface of that heel counter or heel midsole of the shoe. And taking a look at the inner side of course, with once again the Nike Air branding running along the length of the shoe. So very chromatic in design with the black and white overall. Only difference or little accent is that deep blue inside the air unit. And back to the front. Once again, giving you an overall look further out. And now let's take a look from the front to the back or tip or toe of the shoe. And slowly moving towards the back so you can see the various details. And of course, through the length and top of the shoe. And of course, taking a look at the tongue, very heavily bolstered or padded, as you can see, with a very soft and plush feeling to it. And of course, just pulling the tongue slightly up a little bit so you can see the ambush branding on it. And the slightly silvered design So low sheen silver finish, which appears to be filled in that debossed design. Or oh, I beg your pardon, embossed. Oh, it is debossed design. And taking a look at the back of the tongue, you can see the lining as well as the label. And taking a look on the inside, there is a packet of laces in a grip seal packet with the Nike branding on it. it appears to be in full black. And of course, taking a look at the inside details of the shoe. But of course, let's check out the ankle and heel collar padding as well so just squeezing on the padding around the ankle and heel collar so a medium to heavy bolstering with a firm feel to it okay and let's pop out the paper stuffing inside so perhaps we can see slightly better the inside details of the shoe. So right there, giving you a look inside and we can see on the sock liner or insole, the ambush branding with the Nike swoosh towards the back end. And of course the materials label as well, so giving you a look at the inside details of the shoe as best I can. And let's pop the laces back in and taking that overall look right there, keeping it nice and tidy. And now let's do a flexibility bend and twist test with my hands, but actually before that let's take a look at the bottom or sole of the shoe, so you can see the two Nike swooshes, as well as the air branding towards the heel. So giving you a look right there at the sole of the shoe and we can see the Nike air bubble in the heel. And once again, that blue finish inside of 
the Nike Air unit. So just dragging my finger along the surface of the rubber sole and the swoosh as well in white so very high contrast of course the white swoosh inside of the black sole and at the back as well the white Nike swoosh and the air text recessed into the tread design of the sole. So once again just continuing dragging my finger along the various parts. So you can see how the swoosh is suspended over that Nike Air capsule. And just tapping my fingernail on the various parts of the sole. And now let's do a flexibility bend and twist test with my hands to give you some idea of the firmness, stiffness or flexibility of the shoe. and squeezing on the sides as well and just puffing a shoe back in shape and now let's take a look at the right shoe, so setting the left shoe down and in the background as we move the box back in frame and popping it back open again now let's lift up the right shoe from the box and closing everything back down neatly now taking a look at the right shoe of the Nike Air More Up Tempo Low Cross Ambush. And let's do a 360 rotation with this side. And of course, taking some closer in look. Of the shoe. So just squeezing on the air unit there just to give you a look. And of course the sides as well. And once again we see the overall black and white design of this black, white, black colorway Nike Air More Tempo low X ambush And of course, taking a look at the tongue with that silver debossed 
Anbush logo and of course on the inside details as well with that Ambush branding on the sock liner and just removing the paper stuffing once again to give you a nice and clear look at the inside details of the shoe and there is a heel tab as well or heel pull tab in that black and white design that matches up with the pre-fitted factory laces and of course we saw that there was that black packet of spare laces that was tucked inside the left shoe and now let's take a look at the bottom before we take a look at the pair together and now we can take a look at the pair together side by side actually before I do that just giving you a look at that front part of the tongue there so very squishy almost feeling like memory foam okay finally let's take a look at the pair together side by side And from the front to the back and directly from the back and the bottoms of the shoes So that's Nike Air More Uptempo Low Cross Ambush Black and White. Thanks for watching and happy walking!